Now, uh, a few weeks ago, when we had the Birmingham fans on, their song was, we are top of the league, say, we are top of the league. <laughs> well, we might just be hearing that again today, because now, these boys are top of the league. Give us a song, you Derby fans. It, short to the point and all of that and everything and well sung. Uh, we've got to apologise to you uh, first. When we booked you for the show, your game with Sunderland was on Monday. So we went, yeah, come on down, hang out with us, it'd be yeah. great. You can come and get really drunk with us yeah. afterwards as well. And uh, then they've moved the game back in the day. They have, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, right, but unless any of you have got a helicopter waiting outside, you can't go anyway, can you? No, no, <laughs> no. so... You know, based on current format, sir. I know. <laughs> Are we worth it? Yes, I'm yeah. Five star hotel, yeah. Did you? Did you get five star yeah, hotel? No, did they? <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. dear. Yeah, you'll get the bill for that. You no, do know. We don't have that bill. All right. Uh, and of course, oh, the thing is, though, it's all like, hurrah, everything hurrah, Derby. And then we invite you on the week you got booted out of the cup by Plymouth, yeah. you know, and then you lose 2 0 uh, by Stoke in midweek. Just a blip, though, yeah? Just yeah. a blip. Small Blitz, yeah, small blitz. Yeah, yeah, win yeah. today, yeah. One-nil. It's what? One-nil win today. One-nil win today. I'm asked you, yet. Yeah, yeah, that right. question's coming at <laughs> <out of> you. You've <laughs> known it. Yeah. Too yeah. fast. <laughs> OK, 13 <laughs> games left. We know how tight it is at the top of the league. 13 games left. Are you very excited or are you very nervous? Here you go. Look, there's just a quick look at the top, which is a few points between you and the third, but they're not that many, you know, of the fourth and fifth. So, 13 games to go. Excited or nervous? Very nervous, but I have yeah. full faith in Sir Billy Davis. Really? Yeah, full faith. Anybody, anybody think... No, I don't want to be doom and gloom, but does anybody think, well, oh, do you know what? You know, a bit pessimistic, don't think, you know, we'll end up in the playoffs or something. No, no, no. no. Not, not at all, no. not at all. Not at all. Absolute 100% confidence all the way through. I tell you what, our Steve Yard didn't get... Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Our Steve Yard wasn't on the shortlist for World Football of the Year. It's beyond me, I, I'll tell you that. Let's go about your club. Derby County are the greatest team in the world. Just look at the player's commitment. All-time great Steve Bloomer spent almost 13 years at the club. He became the top scorer ever with 332 goals. And then, he was that committed to football, he went off to coach in Germany during World War I. They're more than just a one-man team, though. Well, a bit more. In 1972, Derby won the league using just 16 players all season. And that year, they even went on to beat Real Madrid 4-1 at the baseball ground. Whether you're looking at single players or the team as a whole, the Rams have always had bags of quality. And boss Billy Davis knows just the right combination of quality and hard work to get the results. Yep, the fans will tell you that's the secret. Quality, hard work and a coffee cup. We wish we were all Derby County fans. Oh, oh yeah. very good, very good, very good, very good, very good, very good, very good. And the papers said Billy Davis has fallen out, like the managing director or something. But he says that's all nonsense, isn't it? The papers say all sorts, to be fair, don't they? <laughs> yeah, we know. Can't believe them. Lies. Now, Sunderland today. We know it's going to be one nil because he yeah. said yeah. so. <laughs> one nil. All right. Thank you very much, Derby County fans. <laughs> Thank you very much.